Hi, I'm Silvio and this is part 10 of my Christmas Village 2021 full tutorial series. Up to this point I've done some pre-season work, some planning work, some basic work, some course work and of course some precision detailed work. But I still have a big white flat wasteland that is constantly staring at me with an accusing look. I can't stand it much longer. I need to sit down and listen to all of its complaints and try to relieve it of the pains. The first pure freestyling of this 2021 season, but not the ultimate solution. It's just a ruse to calm it down. Shh. Let's start this therapy session. <laughs> surprised when you said that you were leaving felt some abstract relief instead now that we were even if you go and then hurry along don't drag your silly feet close the door behind
I got some new stuff going on. Starting to feel like some old Asian time But don't come cry to me When your whole world comes crumbling to your feet No, don't come cry to me That 
platform there will be my North Pole se section. Sorry. Okay. And this loop here, this slope here, I have just finished to make with grant access to the North Pole. Maybe just for the uh, sleigh ride. Maybe just for the reindeers. Maybe I don't know yet. And I will need to manage this some more uh, and a very big amount of things are still missing uh, the mountains, the uh, rock paper I will use for mountains etc but don't worry this is not finished it's just the beginning like down there four weeks ago, five weeks ago I'm at that point six weeks ago, sorry so uh, let's continue with something else guys uh, once again with my ruins there with my arcs and my ruins because I need to complete what is still missing the other part of the wall here I still need 25 more centimeters of wall okay I need 25 more centimeters of wall Okay, let's try to get them right here. Uh, oops, 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 then 25 more centimeters. Let's say 25.5. Okay, starting from there to there, 25.5 more centimeters. Hope to have enough bricks left and so I will go on with the glue brush and bricks okay uh, you know the technique I will start now then maybe I will fast forward some uh, half an hour in the future section there that it is right here where I have all this mess here and the rest of the um, of the level there okay so I will stop here I will wait for um, the glue to dry uh, let me just do this hope not to break anything oops 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 okay just a quick preview of the profile of the uh, wall here, okay, and oops, okay, uh, and then I will paint it once it has uh, dried, okay. Uh, let's continue with something else. Let me first clean here. See you, okay, see you now. Uh, I can't leave sincerely this tower like that. I need to complete at least the top here before painting the tower itself, okay? So I made some cutting here and there uh, and let's go, maybe you are uh, recognizing um, the <coughs> support for the battlements there and I will be using them right here all along the face, okay? on top, on the border, and there, okay, 
I will be using here. So I have the battlements, I have the floor here, the top floor, and the base for the battlements. I will do the <laughs> the smart work. <laughs> I will glue them to the tower. Okay, and I mark them. This is left, this is right, this is back, and this is front. Okay. I will proceed step by step. like something out of a movie you see right through me just like you already do of the tower is done I also added a trap door there on on the floor on the back from the side uh, battlements support for the battlements and the depth here I have two centimeters of depth okay all around uh, and um, <laughs> a figurine can stand in there and look towards it I will add the figurines of course Mm, I had to uh, refill, recut uh, some of the uh, corners there because uh, one thing is cutting and supposedly having uh, the correct dimension, one other thing is getting there correctly. And I cut the back, the back piece there. Anyway, it will be hided from the front, front side there. 
So I will wait for the glue to dry, okay? Then I will go with the painting here, okay? See you for something else. I need to do some walls. Five centimeters tall walls, maybe stones, maybe brick walls, I don't know yet. Let's work, then I figure out once I work it and once I start it. Those are good. So five centimeters, five centimeters, okay. will be dedicated to do some painting. I got a lot of things to paint. Uh, obviously, I will not show you the entire process. I will show you some uh, close up here and there, some pieces here and there, because he, or you already know how I paint, but it's part of the full tutorial series. So every step I will show uh, a little bit of every step I'm doing before closing this uh, part uh, 10 of the 2021 series. I will start with the building there. Okay, uh, obviously I need to remove the <coughs> the wall mounted, wall mounted sorry, uh, street lamps and I will try to protect the inside there. I don't want to do a mess with the inside, so I will try to protect it because I already have some texture and I don't want to drip paint colors all over, okay? So I will protect this way, okay? I think it's enough. 
and I will start with a big brush, very big brush because I need to do a lot of surface and uh, black. Black first thing for all uh, the things I need to paint. I will not paint here, there, and there, and here, simply because here I will add something. Maybe you have just figured out. I prepared those walls here that I will glue there, okay? This is a little bit longer because I need to go from each side, then I will go this one here and the other one the other side, okay? So I will not paint those um, base corners, those base walls here, and here I will have the same um, texture paper I have here, I will place it, and here also. So I, I will just paint mainly this surface here and the stairs, obviously, okay? So uh, let's start with the painting, okay? And with some music, of course. You can at least try to start using
hear you breathe, but I can't see If you're right here next to me Something's wrong, wasn't it fun? Is it now we're done? You get dressed, I'm like a mess And you tell me to confess And you tell me to confess Oh I don't know what to say, what to do, how to make you see This is nothing in real life, it might just have been a bad dream You can run, you can hide, but you can't put the blame on me Because you're acting like a volcano Good. I prepared some light gray here. I mixed some white and some gray. Uh, I want these to be a light gray. Then I decide what to do with the arc. And it is time to do the gray for a very long time. And all the black is done here on every piece I needed to paint. Uh, the black is done. As always, I will use a lot of paper because I need to do almost a almost dry, dry, dry brush. So as always, I'm going with almost a, a dry brush and I will go only horizontally. Amazing light, see it all bright, you will never ride. Back to life, I apologize Too soon to say I'm fine Too soon to say I'm fine Oh I don't know what to say, what to do, how to make you see This is nothing in real life, it might just have been a bad dream You can run, you can hide, but you can't put the blame on Cause you're acting like a volcano Tending to be my savior Nothing you do can save us, save us Because you're acting like a volcano And make me feel outrageous You keep teasing me But you're nothing with a break Like a volcano Tending to be my savior Nothing you do can save us Cause you're acting like a volcano Tending to be my savior Nothing you do can save us Save us Because you're acting like a volcano And make me feel outrageous You keep teasing me But you're nothing without me
Up. And as last week, I will start from the ancient Greek park section. Uh, I painted, I painted a lot, and this is the result of the columns and of the gate. No more fluo colors, no more psychedelic colors for the gate there, okay, and the columns. Uh, I choose to go yellowish, but also with some black. Uh, as a background, mm, ancient columns, damaged columns, um, everything is there, okay? So then the brick column there with some black, gray, uh, brown and dry white brush, okay? As always, okay? Here too, the same thing with the column under Athena there, then Mercury, Poseidon as always, and uh, Juno there. Uh, the columns uh, are oldish, okay? I choose to go with this uh, yellow color. Uh, it is mm, some sort of marble damaged by the uh, age, by the time. And also here the mini columns there, same result with some gray on top, gray on bottom, and then black uh, as background, uh, as first layer, and then yellowish. Uh, Zeus, same thing down there. And etc, etc. Down, okay. Here I have 20 centimeters from the gate to the border for some more scenes and 17 to 20 centimeters inside the park for even more action, even more scenes, micro scenes. Um, up there, finally, I have a decent uh, background for the last levels, last tiers there. Uh, still a lot of work to do. This is only the beginning for what is there on the, the third level, here at third level, then four, four and a half, etc. You haven't seen me. Oh, <laughs> just there, a, a little way there because I haven't fixed anything yet. So uh, it's still on the move and uh, I don't want to fall it to fall down. Okay. And I've measured down there uh, the, um, the height there if the um, train uh, will have problems, but with that height there from here down to the race there, no problem at all. The only, I think the only <clears throat> um, tunnel there, the only gallery will be this one. From the other side, I think I will leave it like that, okay, in plain sight. Mm, just some mountains, some rock paper here and there, then there. <laughs> Impossible to view like this. Uh, I need to add some um, rock paper. Oh, I know. Uh, let me just show you from here. Okay, so the train will go there with no problems. Here I'll have some uh, uh, rock paper or maybe polyurethane foam. I don't know yet. Uh, still thinking about it. This was pure freestyle. The rest will not be pure freestyle. I need to think about what's getting the scene together with the base there. Uh, the slope there, uh, up, 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 uh, there. I've already told you here. This will be North Pole, North Pole section, sorry. Uh, Santa 
Wonderland there with the buildings with the reindeers etc. Only thing I could this is the only thing I am uh, <laughs> I'm telling you right now the rest is a secret then um, what I did here not a, a, a lot of work but because the painting takes a lot of time two layer of black there I needed to hide everything so I have to wait for the first layer to dry then apply the second layer or the, the painting took four hours six hours maybe more just for the painting and here the wall finally done finally uh, achieved the rest the 25 more centimeters that were missing okay uh, so here is the result now with the 25 more centimeters there and uh, the painting done with some black some gray some dry br dry uh, brown brush and some uh, white brush obviously dry white brush and from the other side too Okay, so this part here is completely done. Uh, surprise there. The building there with the street lamps switched on. They work, guys. I just need... Okay, uh, you don't... Uh, you want to see the effect uh, by night? Uh, let me just place the camera in the right position here. Then I will switch off the lights. Uh, let me just show you everything. Okay, just a moment, please. I will switch off all the lights. And this is the night effect. So guys, it, it really takes everything on the light. And look at the shadow, maybe you aren't seeing them. Maybe from the distance here, you can appreciate the shadows there, the X shadows and the shadows. So the inside lamps inside there, they take the inside plus a part of the left and the right section and the external street lamps get everything else. The front here with some more um, park bench and then it, <coughs> The one on the left will also illuminate the building that is still missing down there. Okay, so this is the overall effect. Let me just go once again with some lights. Okay, so uh, the wall there. You have seen me doing the wall there, and then I added the wall here, painted with black, uh, gray, uh, dry um, brown brush, dry uh, green brush, and then dry white brush, okay? The stairs, same thing for the stairs, black, gray, and brown, not uh, green, but brown, yes, and the inside stairs too, and... Uh, the battlements here, same thing uh, with uh, black, grey, uh, a little of brown, then a white brush uh, because uh, <laughs> I need white brush for the, um, the lines, for the illumination of the everything, okay, it gives light. Then here and yeah, <laughs> she is always present. So I added the, um, the floor there, pure um, uh, wooden floor with the trap door there and the inside there, okay? Um, and you can stand on top of it and just look at the camera, please. And then some windows, the, <clears throat> the door, the wooden door there. Here it is, the wooden door and the columns. And sorry, the, the faces of the uh, tower there with some gray, some 
uh, dry brown, dry green and dry white. And this is the effect from the distance for the tower there, a mix of color. And everything is standing, still missing the wall here, the pattern, the paper, I will print the, the pattern there, the same pattern I have here uh, on the wall there. Uh, and same thing on the other side and here, I, on the floor here, I will use the same uh, floor I have here inside, my usual floor. Uh, then some uh, fences, some fences all along here, maybe I will use the canal fences here. Yes, they are suited. Uh, and so some uh, mm, end rails and balusters need to be added here on the stair and inside. Uh, some uh, mm, something is need to be uh, retouched, a little touch of uh, paint here and there. I've just finished uh, placing uh, all this uh, some minutes ago. And another another window there, okay. Uh, black with uh, yellow there in order to let you see from the distance that it is a window and painted but it has another effect uh, the wall here uh, i don't know maybe here uh, so gray black gray a uh, little of brown then white dry brush uh, as always uh, i don't think it is a bad bad result but it's my opinion, maybe you have different opinion. And from this side too, some more levels there. Okay, uh, I will next time, oops, sorry for the camera, next time I will work on the third, fourth and all the other levels. I need to improve the levels there. Uh, part 10, this is part 10 and the wall from this side too. Okay, I have just seen it, but another time. Uh, part 10. Oh, yes, almost halfway, but I'm not uh, halfway with the project there, the <coughs> village there. Uh, I'm behind schedule, very behind schedule, a lot behind schedule, an enormous <laughs> behind the schedule. Sorry, guys. Um, Okay, uh, this is the overall look once again, okay, and oh yes, the street lamps, I haven't shown you the overcome of the street lamps, the lamps here are hiding behind this wall, but you can see one of the wires there, and the rest are here, the four wires here, connected with uh, an octopus uh, split, uh, split wire, octopus split wire, and everything else okay uh a lot of thing to do here i don't like white maybe i will add some um some floor and this is solid enough to support buildings so here i will put some lamax buildings i think one two maybe three two maybe three buildings will fit in there in the back there to add some more height there in the background then uh, here in the front some uh, scenes as always a scene inside everything else uh, maybe i will change the pattern there i will use the same pattern the same colors the same bricks i have inside there i don't know mm, still not convinced still I need to think a little more about it. Uh, then I need to make some improvements here on the pier, on the docks. Okay, uh, this is all for the final recap, guys. Uh, I think it's time, it is time for my outro. The little therapy session was very profitable and now it has no more complaints or at least less complaints than before and it will never admit it but inside it is somehow happier when you have a lot of things to paint when you have the equivalent of 2000 square feet of surface to paint you got the impression to be stuck 
not progressing with the overall project. I haven't shown you everything, but all I did this week was very time consuming. The wall there, 25 centimeters, two times, because I have two bricks each, a level of bricks. Uh, the painting, three layers of paint, then white brush, here the same, the surface of the tower to paint, two layers of paint, of black paint on the fences, on the gates down there, the columns, etc. Very, very time consuming. And yes, I know, I had also the uh, last levels on the back there, but still, I get the impression not to have a progressive and I feel guilty. I feel guilty because uh, I feel I have just progressed this from last week and I will feel guilty for the next few days. So please don't forget to subscribe, comment and give thumbs up. Thank you for watching, thank you for bearing my absolutely awful English and if you wish, see you next time.